One says, never mind the dog, beware the owner. <laughs> and it has a, a, a gun. The signs didn't keep a stranger away from Derek Thomas's driveway. Yeah, he was up to no good. <laughs> Definitely. Saturday night, Thomas noticed a shadow lurking outside his Pendleton Road home. He was locking up after watching a late night football game. And I saw him come from here. He grabbed this handle and he grabbed that door handle. His wife and three kids, ages three, seven and nine, all asleep inside. So he went out barefoot. I pulled my gun and said, what the hell are you doing in my truck? Get out of my truck. And he crawled back out of the truck and basically tried to crawl around the back. He did stand up, but when I shot the gun two times, he got down onto the ground and stayed. Thomas says he stopped the stranger before anything was taken, then told his wife to call 911 and bring out backup. The family's great Dane named Tank. Started barking going crazy. I said, you hear that? That's my 150 pound dog and I promise you if you run, I'm not chasing you, but he's gonna catch you. Thomas posted the pictures of Matthew Conklin's arrest to Facebook, saying he was carrying 3,500 bucks cash. Police say they found cap needles, heroin, and a small bag of suspected meth in his pockets. Now, goodness gracious. Court records say Conklin offered cops the cash not to take him to jail. The 25-year-old has a history of drug convictions and was due in court Wednesday to be sentenced on another drug case. I'm afraid to let you out of jail because you may very well kill yourself. All you have to do is run into a bad batch of dope and you're dead. No regrets from Thomas. Heart adrenaline pounding a mile a minute. Man and man's best friend protecting their home. I work every day hard for my money and it makes me upset, you know, that somebody's out here in my stuff, stealing my stuff.